Hi guys, welcome to Code Bashers. So guys, the on-campus technical interviews for LTI Mindtree company has started from today only. Okay, so here I am with the video. In this particular video, total two interview experience I will be discussing for LTI Mindtree that happened today only. Okay, so the exam for LTI Mindtree was I think two weeks back and results were were announced last week. And from today onward, the interviews has also started. So guys, make sure that you are watching this video till the end because lot of technical questions I will be discussing in this particular video. So lot of your doubts will be cleared and you will get to know that what type of questions you have to prepare for the interviews. Okay. So guys, before moving ahead, lot of videos for LTI Mindtree interview experience I have already posted on this channel. You can check out those videos in this particular playlist. This video also I will be adding in this playlist only and the link of this playlist I will give you in the description box. Okay, so guys, make sure that you are present on this channel because regularly I will be making videos regarding the interview experience of Mindtree. Okay, today also, tomorrow also, and day after tomorrow also, I will keep on making the videos. Okay, so make sure that you are joining this Telegram group also. This is this Telegram group is specifically for the 2025 batch students. So currently, Mindtree hiring, TCS hiring, and Cognant hiring is going on. So all the updates regarding various hirings you will be getting in this particular Telegram group. Okay, so I hope all these things are clear to you. Before moving ahead, do hit that like and subscribe button for this channel, and do join this Telegram group. So, guys, now let's start the interview experience. Okay, so guys, first of all, let's just discuss the first interview experience. Total two interview experiences I will be discussing. So, let's just discuss the first one, and then I will tell you that you can from where you can find the notes for the for preparing for such interviews. Okay, so first question that was asked from the candidate was introduce yourself. So, guys, again. Very important question as per your interview is concerned because you can in, uh, here the interviewer will get to know you. You can include your educational background, your skills, your projects, your internship, your extracurricular activities. All these things you can include here, and the interviewer will get to know you better, and the question can follow up. Okay. Next was explain project. So guys, whenever you are giving the interview for any IT company, not just LTI Mindtree, any IT company, you should have at least two technical projects in your resume, and you should be able to. Explain them. Now, next was project technologies uh, were asked. Okay, the questions based on project technologies were asked. So, if you have your projects on machine learning, then question related to uh, basic questions related to machine learning you should know. So, you should prepare basic IT subjects also, and you should prepare the technologies that you have used in your project also. Okay. Next question was difficulty in project. Okay. So again, which difficulty you faced? Any difficulty you faced, you can explain to the interviewer. Next question was which technology you prefer? So either Java, Python, Spring Boot, machine learning. So anything you prefer, you can answer it. Okay. But do answer that technology only in which you are confident in, and you can uh, you can answer the questions that follow. Okay. Next is <clears throat> uh, I followed the technology and they asked deep questions on those technologies. Okay. So if you choose machine learning, so they they can ask you what is naive Bayes algorithm, what is logistic regression, what is linear regression. So all these things you should know regarding the technology you are making project on. You are writing in the resume, so do not lie in the resume and just uh, tell uh, or be honest with the interviewer that what you know. Okay. So I hope this this seems clear to you. Next were like <clears throat> they gave you a code, okay, and they told that you have to solve this error. Okay, a particular error was given to the candidate. And he was asked to solve that error. Okay, uh, was uh, how to solve that error? Okay, so I hope this question is also clear to you. Next were uh, there were three coding questions asked and three SQL queries were there. You can see here three coding questions: Fibonacci, factorial, count digit in number. So this is an online uh, online interviews that are going on. And you, will, if you are asked to write the code, then you will have to share your screen and write the code there. Okay, so on any editor. So three coding questions: Fibonacci, factorial, count digit in a number were asked. Next were the SQL queries were also asked like what are the SQL clauses, drop table so syntax for drop table. Next was there were more queries uh, which uh, the candidate did, did not understand but you can ex uh, expect some SQL queries also from the interviewer. So the motive of this video is to tell you that what type of questions are asked, what topics are important for particular interviews. Okay, so that you can prepare for them. Okay, and as I have told you earlier in the video that I will also. Tell you about the notes from which you can prepare all these things. So here are the notes which are present on my top mid page. These are important interview IT subject notes. In these particular notes, we have total twelve subjects that are covered. So we have OOPs, C plus plus OOPs questions, Java OOPs questions, Python OOPs questions, DBMS questions, SQL queries questions, which are very commonly asked in the interviews. 
coding questions which are commonly asked in the interviews so if you will uh, see see these notes so all these all three of these coding questions are already discussed in these particular notes okay so these particular notes are prepared from the real life interview experiences for different different companies okay because see for every company subject and questions remain same only so you just have to prepare these notes okay so if you have you are preparing for last minute and if you have want to revise your concepts so these notes can be beneficial for you and here we have given the commonly asked questions for machine learning as well cloud computing as well because we know that many of you will be having your project on these technologies and you will not be knowing that how to what type of questions can be asked from you and what answers you have to give so in these particular notes we have for every subjects we have a dedicated pdf for every subjects we have questions as well as their answers that how you have to answer it in the interview okay so i hope this thing is clear to you okay and if you are interested in buying these notes so these are at a very nominal price of rupees 99 the links of these notes you will be given in the description box you can check them out okay and before moving ahead do follow do join this telegram group because lot of updates regarding different different companies i will be keep on posting on this telegram group okay this is a dedicated telegram group for 2025 batch students now continue the video with the second second students interview experience okay so second students interview experience was they asked for the introduction and preferred language so again introduction is very important as per your interview is concerned now what is your preferred language it can be either java c++ python so interviewer will be asking questions based on your preferred language okay so just a second yeah <clears throat> sorry okay so the question was what is the difference between list and array so again it's a very commonly asked difference so list in python in list we can store multiple data type at once but in array we can only store one type of uh, one type of element okay so arrays are much more faster than list okay this is one other difference what is interpreted language what are the built in data structures in python so what are built in data structures in python there is list there are arrays okay uh, there are tuples there is dictionary so all these are the inbuilt data structures in python so i hope it is clear to you next what is the difference between list and tuples so similarly lists are mutable tuples are immutable in nature tuples are more faster as compared to list okay what are generators in python what are decorators in python use of self in python so self keyword is similar to this keyword in java so it references to the current object so i hope this particular interview experience is also clear to you the main motive of this interview experience is c to tell you that what type of questions and what topics are important for you okay so these are all the questions which are very commonly asked in the interviews and all these questions with their answers are already present in these notes that i have already told you okay so total 12 subjects you will be getting inside these notes so if you are preparing for the interviews then this uh, then these particular notes can be very much beneficial for you okay so you can check out for yourself the links will, of this notes you will find in the description box okay two interview questions i have covered in this video and majority of the questions are already present in these notes okay and do join this telegram group if you have not joined it till now it is a dedicated telegram group for 2025 batch students so i hope all the questions that i have discussed are clear to you now you have a better better understanding that what things to prepare and what topics are important okay so do hit that like and subscribe button for this channel because we will continuously making more such videos on this channel regarding mind tree tcs and cognant also so guys thank you for watching this video